Hello, Matrix. Let's talk about mixed precision training, an absolute game changer in the deep learning world. By the end of this chat, you'll see why it's a must know for anyone dabbling with neural networks. Mixed precision training is like having two different sets of tools in your deep learning toolbox, each with their unique strengths. One set is your 32 bit floating point numbers, or high precision tools. They're great for accuracy but can be a bit demanding on your computer's memory and processing power. Then, you've got your 16-bit floating point numbers, or low-precision tools, lighter on resources but not as accurate. Now, imagine being able to use these tools together, reaping the benefits of both. That's exactly what mixed precision training does. It employs low-precision computations where possible to save on resources and uses high-precision computations where accuracy is crucial. But what about the precision loss, you might ask? Here's where the secret sauce comes in. Loss scaling. In the backward pass of the network training, when we're calculating gradients, we scale the loss value up to prevent small gradients from vanishing due to lower precision. Then we scale it back down, preserving accuracy while maintaining efficiency. And voila! Mixed precision training lets you train your networks faster, using less memory, without losing out on accuracy. It's like upgrading your deep learning engine for better performance. That's it for now. But remember, the world of AI is vast and full of exciting concepts waiting to be discovered. If you enjoyed this discussion, drop your thoughts in the comments and hit the subscribe button for more insightful AI content. Keep learning, folks.